today in Warren County, Christopher Hubbard was sentenced to 56 years to 61, 61 and a half years in prison. That's essentially a life sentence for the 38 year old from Middletown. The defendant's lucky that we're not here on an aggravated murder charge. This video shows how easily this 2020 shootout with police could have turned deadly. Watch in slow motion and you can see Middletown Police K-9 Coda dart toward the suspect Christopher Hubbard's car. After Hubbard fired the first shot, several officers fired back. Coda was not hit, but his handler, Middletown Police Sergeant Denny Jordan, was. The first round entered his shoulder, not too far away from his heart, and the second round struck his duty holster, which caused injury to his hand. Two shots on target by the defendant that could have ended Officer Jordan's life. Two other police officers were shot at following a police chase that ended here in the front yard of a Turtle Creek Township home. Earlier this month, Hubbard was found guilty of several charges, including three counts of felonious assault. He fired five times at law enforcement and it wasn't until his gun jammed that he was finally forced to stop shooting. But I would argue this is the same transaction because there were five shots, a rapid succession, in one event. It wasn't shooting three separate events. It's actually the same transaction. Defense attorneys asked for the minimum sentence, but Judge Timothy Teep noted Hubbard hasn't taken responsibility or shown remorse. I believe that you are dangerous, sir. I believe that you are manipulative. Teep gave Hubbard an opportunity to speak. Mr. Hubbard, is there anything you'd like to say before I pronounce your sentence? He didn't want me to speak on the case, so I won't, but go Dingles and God I trust. And given the seriousness of this case, no one in that courtroom seemed amused by Hubbard's comment. Again, headed to prison for more than 50 years.